Hey guys, Teen here from BlueSense Digital. How do you set up enhanced conversion tracking on Google Ads when using the GA4 tracking method? I believe this is a relatively recent addition to GA4's tracking method, so let's dive straight in. So diving straight into it, the first step is just to give this a bit of context. So if you go into your Google Ads account, go to Tools and Settings, Conversions, we are looking specifically at the GA4 conversion tracking event. And again, just to give this a bit of context for a manually installed tracking code, we have the option to enable enhanced conversion tracking on that tracking code. So as you can see here, on, sorry, enhanced conversion tracking, you turn enhanced conversions on, um, and then in the tracking code that you install on the back end of the website, you add these JavaScript variables into the tracking code. What that does is it takes the relevant data from the checkout or that gets sorry, it takes the relevant data that gets added into the website during the checkout process. It then uses this JavaScript variable and syncs that through into Google Ads to better inform the algorithm in terms of details around those specific conversions that came through and therefore gives a much more accurate tracking experience or just a much more accurate tracking system based on this enhanced conversion tracking and all of this specific data that's get sorry, specific data that gets pushed from the website backend into Google Ads. So this is obviously a manually installed code and this is what we ideally always want to be using and this is what we ideally prefer. But if you only have the option to use the GA4 tracking code and this GA4 purchase event, how do you install or how do you activate that enhanced conversion tracking on GA4 so that you can get that additional data into Google Ads as well? So to do that, head on over to your Google Ads account, or sorry, your Google Analytics account. From here, go down to admin at the bottom left, then click on data streams over here to go into your data streams, then select your website data stream, and then scroll down here to configure tag settings, open that up. And then once that's open, um, if this doesn't automatically pop up, you can just say show more um, and then click on allow user provided data capabilities. Click on that, go into there. And then as you can see here, we have the option to either automatically detect user provided data or we have the option to manually put in the uh, either CSS selector or the JavaScript variable that I just mentioned in the manually installed website tracking code. So because we've installed J4 on the website, there's no need for us to manually put in the JavaScript variables. So just ensure that in the scenario when you're using J4 that you've just ticked the automatically detect user provided data over here and that should automatically enable enhanced conversion tracking in Google Ads. So that's it, hopefully that was a help. Hope you learned something there. If you enjoyed it, like, subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.